Hello beautiful people, welcome back to 100 days to ML. In today's video, we will look at hierarchical or mean shift clustering. So let's go. Okay guys, let's see how the mean shift clustering works. When we create when we call the mean shift clustering algorithm, the first task is to find the pattern of the data points. So it will create multiple plots across the data points and then it will check the mode or the point where all the other data points are tending to move. If you see these points, this is moving towards this point so this is the centroid of this particular cluster and here this particular point is the centroid as all these points are moving towards this point and here in these in this cluster all the data points are moving to this particular point so as mentioned over here in drawback the algorithm is not highly scalable as it requires multiple nearest neighbors searches. So it searches for the nearest neighbor multiple times to find the centroid and then it clusters. Let's see how mean shift works. So as in other algorithms, we don't have to provide the number of clusters to be created as the estimate bandwidth will do the work for us so we will predefine some centers and use the same make blobs from scikit-learn's data set with thousand samples and then we will apply the bandwidth of quantile point two and samples 500 here i have tried to mention the Centroid so 1, 1, minus 1, minus 1, and 1, minus 1. The algorithm will find the nearest centroids and gives us 0 0.90, minus 0 0.9, minus 0 0.90, minus 1, 0 0.96, and 1.1 as the centroids. So this 0 0.96 and 1.1 1 .1 corresponds to these point these centroids one one minus point nine zero minus one point zero corresponds to this minus one and minus one and point nine zero and minus point nine corresponds to one and minus one so let us plot the cluster and we see the centroids are these darker points and all the other data points are moving towards the centroids. So the work of mean shift clustering is to shift the mean to find the mode where all the points are converged points are moving towards this darker center and here the same thing they are moving towards this darker center. So this is how the mean shift clustering works hope you guys like this video please subscribe my channel share it with your friends who are looking to learn machine learning comment your thoughts on this